I got a new number. She, you just left me in the past with your old one, huh? Ah, it ain't even like that. I why do you, why? Bro, you entertaining her, bro. Why do you mean it ain't even like that? Yes, good dog. Yes, you in the past. Fuck going out of here, man. You got a lot going on. I ain't had no chance to text you. She, ah, okay. Well, you can give me your new number now. Hell uh, no. Seven, three. Bro, what is you doing? Call me Master Zangas, I'm a flaky bass. You see the stupid title, bro? I'm not gonna waste no time in the long intro. Let's get into it, man. Okay. So make sure y'all go subscribe ASAP. Appreciate you. Huh? On the last episode of Dragon Ball Z. Nah, but on the last episode of Black Chicago be like part 119, part 13, I locked in with Sandy to see about a decent little new apartment situation. While I was trying to grab something to eat from Jerk 48, I ended up running in a teasy side chick. Lord knows I ain't need nobody letting him know I was alive, so I was ducking for show. Come to find out, she don't even rock with him no more. Mm. Talk about a close call. Right as I was getting up out of there, Tell me why I run into pretty skinny. Shorty that had set me up. Why I instantly get <laughs> she on some Nini Brooks type of things. <laughs> right on that. Hop in this truck real fast. Pressed up about the situation. She claimed she was just trying to get money for her kids. Like I ain't almost get my life taken. <sighs> Fake threatened her life. I ain't gonna lie. But I end up letting her go. She needed that for real. Playing with my was like that ain't cool. I'm not gonna lie, bro. It's like. Bro, the English is leaving my head. Ah! Uh, don't you think she might do that shit again because you friend her life? I don't know, man. Yeah. Unknown. But damn. It's not it's not a good thing to make somebody uh, a, a parentless. But, but damn, man. To me, Detective Tuoli and Tip was waiting to find out what was the cause of death for Buddy that Brazil popped in the alley, itching for any answers they could scrape up. Later that night, Tip had me slide to her crib for a romantic rose petal rendezvous for two. Had lamb chops, macaroni, and asparagus on the menu. <laughs> Didn't even know she knew how to cook like that. We ended up watching TV, stumbled on the news, found out Pronto was alive and in critical condition. You better know the motorcyclist hit my line immediately. <laughs> immediately. I in the bathroom to take his call. He let me know that he was aware that Pronto wasn't dead and that I basically had 24 hours to make sure the job was done. Well, he was going to have to make a harsh decision. And you have to tell me twice. I hit <sighs> Tip with a little script about something going on with my little sister so I can get up out of there. She was disappointed but supportive. Gave me her key to get back in and everything. I ain't want to leave, but my hands was tied behind my back. Mm. I raced to the store. And got a, I'm a nurse and I passed my NCLEX starter pack together. I came up with the bright idea of sneaking into the hospital incognito, undercover as a new hire. Security wasn't trying to be too cooperative, but a fellow employee ended up getting me <laughs> right where I needed to be. A fellow employee. Put my cover fell in the prop. Bro, this nigga was, I'm not gonna lie, this, this goofball was tweaking for no reason. It's like, bro, I, we, like, bro, it's a difference if, like, it's different if, like, if for me, you ask him for someone's help and they work at the place you at and they got an attitude. It's different. That one is, like, it's valid for you to, like, get mad at them or, like, for me, bug up on them. But the person is like, yo, bro, I can't help you. There's nothing I can do. Or I, I try. They even try to, like, to help you with whatever, whatever you got going on. Man, I wish he was getting okay. Let me not wish. <laughs> wishing death, wishing death upon a person is not it. I believe service her body at the hospital. Nah, he need to get it. He need to get his ass slapped up, boy. He need to catch a fade in the back, bro. Buddy bugged up and everything. I'm just standing there looking dumb as hell. Had a doctor try to talk to me about some shit I ain't know nothing about. Made it past that situation by the skin of my teeth. A day full of close calls for sure. I had finally made it to Pronto room. He couldn't understand why I was doing what I was doing, but I'm not gonna lie, bro. I'm not wasting time with the talking. 
This is not no 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 movie we talking about. Hey man, I just had to do it, bro. I just, why the hell is you showing your face to the goofball? Instantly in there, mask all up, check the area. Boom, boom, boom! Knock his maduro in. I'm out of here. What is you doing? Quite honestly, what if he what if he ends up on some like fifty cent type of thing, man? You end up shooting him, he lives. It's like, bro, come on, man. It want for him to understand. I ain't waste no time in making sure that he checked for real. Once I got back to Tip Crib, she was concerned about what was really going on. Wanted actual insight. And that's when I asked for y'all help. Hey, big dog. I do, I'm not, uh, it, maybe that's just me for me. Uh, even if like you were like you close to me or like, you know a lot of information about me that other people don't know. My dog, if there's something like a big secret that I have, your stupid is not finna find out, nigga. I'm dying with that thing. What is you talking about? You about it, bro? She's a fed. I'm not even in the streets. Like, come on, man. Well, the people have spoken. What the hell are they? What the hell did they see? And y'all have elected for me to keep that information to myself. Say less. Thank you. I, nah, baby, really was just you know. The hell? Asthmatic complications with my baby sister. Everything's cool. <laughs> <but> I, <laughs> asthmatic. <laughs> definitely appreciate your energy for me though. She okay, babe. Just checking. Can we finish watching our movie now, and then proceed to the production after? She. Nah, for sure, babe. We can watch it, and definitely get to the feature film after. <laughs> Her love language, clearly. She turned the TV on. After that movie, I was finna kill some again. The next morning, I was knocked out. The hours prior was murder she wrote, for real, for real. I wake up, stretch. I'm on the couch by myself. I look over. I see a piece of paper with a heart on it on the table. Bro, why did I thought these were like ants or something? Look, look at this. Like here, just, just observe here. But, I see a piece of paper with a heart on it on the table. Oh, it's a fan. I was like, what the hell is that? Seemed like some she probably left me. I sit up. I thought they got some superhero roaches in that bit. Like, damn man, that bitch is fast as hell. Grab the paper, unfold it. It say Grand Rising Handsome. You got the key to my house and my heart. Had to go to work, but I love you. Cute as hell. Right after that, I get a FaceTime. I found my phone, grab it. It's Sandy answering I. Hello, she Grand Rising King. I got some good news. I oh yeah. She, I got your keys. You can actually move in today. Feel my heart. Get to it. Damn near cried. You hear me? <laughs> Thankful. I you know, Sandy, you are a saint. <laughs> she, boy, get your dumb step out of here. But I'ma leave the key under the mat. Um, I got something to do, so I'ma link up with you later to get the money. Ah, that's more than okay. You done started my day the right way. Mm. Thank you so much, queen. She, nah, for sure, but I met you later, okay? Ah, all right, and hung up. Just what I wanted to hear. The moment after, it hit me my little sister didn't have my new number. I FaceTime her, answer a she, cause I definitely called you yesterday. I guess you got a new number? Ah, type sh what you wanted. She, cause I'm ready to come home. But who you running from? Why you change your number? I, I ain't running from nobody. It was just time to change my line. She, nah, whoever got that shirt hanging around your neck, that's who you running from. I, actually, that's the last thing I'm running from. Trust me. She, boy, anyways, come get me. I, I, I'm finna get up and get dressed and then I'm finna be on my way. She, I bet. I, I, and hang up. Pick my sister up and go home. Love. Mm. I went and got my garbage bag of clothes out the truck so I can get ready for the day. After I showered and got dressed, I took the ropes I had in my head. Damn, them motherfuckers contributed to the aesthetic of a murder the night before. I wasn't trying to match up with no type of eyewitness sketch mm -hmm. or nothing, or no fashion. Right before I head out the door, I get a FaceTime call. I put my bag down, take out my phone, and who it is? Teasy. Oh, I thought it was that 
Wait, that goofball is pronto. The one that got murked in the in the in the hospital. Oh, TZ. Wait, how the hell? How the hell he got his man number? I ain't even answer. I had to let that one go to voicemail. I ain't gonna lie to you. The next moment after though, I get a text message. I look, it's TZ. I already know you're not in a live X. Might as well answer now, G. It's funny because he did it like the way he be talking. Oh, folks. <laughs> I already know you're not alive, fix. I don't know if y'all see this. Oh, man. I'm I'm, I'm, I'm covering the thing. <laughs> Anxiety on a thou. I look, it's teasy. I already know you're not in a live, fix. Might as well answer <laughs> now, G. Anxiety <laughs> on a thousand. Right after he get the call and again, I decided to answer. Ah, right, hello? He, now I gotta get to you, folks. You snap. Hit my ex with a switcheroo. Traded Joe life for Prontos. I ain't even know you had it in you, folks. Mm. You snap, gang. <laughs> you snap. That's raw as hell on facts. I type. Sh he, Pronto one the one fucking with my playing in my face, abusing my trust, treating me like I'm some type of goofy. That was you, folks. That was Joe. You got an answer for that, G. What could I say? Guilty is charged. He, I'm going to be much more precise with this this time around. I'm going to get a witch. Catch the hat I'm supposed to. God don't play about me, Fex. Yeah, this man is, yeah, he's a loony, man. He's, I can't say that word on YouTube. Retire. You can finish that word. I'm not gonna bro. I'm not gonna say I'm the best person or like oh I'm the most religious person, whatever. Like how do I put this? Oh, I know anything about my religion. Like, bro, I don't get it when goofballs be talking about like, hey, what is, what does he mean God got me, folks? How the hell does he got you if you're about to do murder? And you, you literally did attempt a murder and y'all almost killed the person. So what the hell well, it is attempted murder. I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. I'ma get a witch. Catch the hat I'm supposed to. God don't play about me, Fex. It's only a matter of time. <sighs> ah, you just gonna have to get up with me then. LOL and heat. I love a challenge. <laughs> See you soon, Fex. I hang up. My new name was just gonna have to be the gingerbread man, and that's just what it was. I pick my bag up and head it out. I pull up to my TT crib to pick Brazil up. Soon as I park, I look. Brazil walking up with another human on her back. The hell? I instantly turn, locked off. She try to open it. No bueno, she looking at me crazy. I let the window down, hoping some understanding come through. She unlocked the door. I, what, what, what is this extra baggage you got me? <laughs> she, bro, auntie told me if I take her with me, I can make some more money. Kid hop down. She hi. She Who the fuck is you? He's an issue. Ah, uh uh. The same money that you can make at my house, you can still make at TT house. Hey. What are you trying to come home for anyway? She, cause I'm ready to come home, brother. Stop. Ah, bro. I barely want you there. Where's you gonna keep her at? Brazil. Brother, it's only gonna be for a few days. Ah, you ain't even say a couple days, Brazil. I'm not gonna lie, bro. She talking about like she gonna make money. Hey, might as well, might as well, like, uh, give me, give, he gotta give, he gotta, she gotta give him half of the money, man, real talk. Deal. You said a few, it's always something with you. She, brother, she ain't even no trouble, I'ma keep her around me, you ain't even gonna know she there. Alright, whatever, man. Whatever Damn. I tell you, you giving me a percentage. She negative, you tweet. Okay, and then get back. Bro, instantly locking the doors, bro. Yo, bro, fuck them kids, nigga. Yo, isn't it, bro? I hope he locks the door, bro. I hope he locks the door. This stupid ass nigga, corporate, beautiful ass nigga, he finna let her in with the extra package. Proceeded to open the door for this human to hop in the back of my truck. Uninvited, unrequested. Kid hopped in my truck like the ink was dry on. Man, the kid ain't even do nothing, bro. It's just like. Wrong time, wrong place, man. I ain't gonna lie. Some adoption paperwork. Come for table. Brazil bop in the front seat. Look at me like I'm tweaking. Man, man. Hell nah, boy. Instantly, she trying to open the door. Lock that motherfucker, man. 
Give me the papers right now, big dog. Give me money. I'm not finna be having no random man. Ch nobody charging my car, man. The hell? Bro, this is the problem of like taking care of other people's kids. If you're the one responsible for that kid, if something happened, God forbids anything happened to that kid. And considering I didn't want I didn't want to take care of the kid or he didn't he didn't want to take care of the kid, if something had bad happens, who's gonna be at fault? Oh, you're you're the adult, this and that. They're gonna blame they're gonna blame corporate instead of like uh Brazil. Bro, get that little nigga out my car, bro. Irritated Real talk. my soul. I just skirt off, head to the crib. We hey man, up. I can pop. never me can never be me, boy. I Brazil, where we at? Ah, my new crib. She, you got a new place? Ah, yes, ma'am. With her upstairs and all that. She, upstairs? Wow. I would have never expected you to level up from where you was at. <laughs> Yo, bro, she disrespectful, bro. <laughs> Yo, bro, I'm denied, nah, bro. We gotta sign her. Yo, she gotta give me some of the money she finna give, bro. Hell no. Nah. Never would have thought, huh? Chuckling, I. Nah. It's only <laughs> one thing that I could say to that. The devil is a liar. Yeah, 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 yeah. The devil is a liar. Yeah, 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 yeah. Getting that Lisa Brooks ain't gonna tell me what he can't do. Victory is mine. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hello, Brazil. I, right, brother. Right. I, right. you ain't gotta tell me. All right, y'all, let's go. And I bell out. Brazil and the younger human do the same. <laughs> the younger human. <laughs> step into my new residence. Brazil and the little one step through to look around. It's convenient that the crib got more rooms. Ugh, bro. Still the little one. Whoa, there's bunk beds in here. I can definitely get used to this place. Ah, oh no worries. You ain't gotta get used to staying <laughs> nowhere. Real Kanye shrug, pimp off. Walking into the kitchen from upstairs, Brazil. So I'm getting upstairs, right, brother? Walking up to her. Ah, is them braids too tight? <laughs> if anything, you and the little one finna take these bunk beds in here. Oh she folks. <laughs> you ain't gonna give it to me like that. I just take this room right here. Estimation with a deep side eye. You irritating. She, you want to know something else? I'm hungry too. Ah, well, of course, I ain't got nothing in here. I just got the place today. She, that's cool. I'm going to just order me and my line some from Uber Eats. But Auntie gave me the link card to get you for groceries. Ah, link card? Hmm? Now you living in your purpose. She, huh? And handed it to me. Stepping forward and taking it. Ah, all right, I'm finna go to the grocery store right now. Text me what you want, what my line might want, and make sure to text me the pin number. She, okay, ah, right, all right, I'll be right back. And dipped out to go shop for two younger ones like I had kids or something. A kid in the candy store when you got food stamps though. Link car, black car, same thing. I go straight to freezer. King crab legs, standard size box of cinnamon toast crunch. Of course not. Think big. <laughs> Yo, this goofball about to max out that car, bro. Individual sell packs of noodles? No, I need three boxes. Is you cool? Bro, you doing too much, I man. Was loading up on fruit snacks. Who I see looking at me? Amber. She ran into your chat. What you blocked me for? I I didn't even block you. Bro, I'm ignoring her stupid, bro. I don't even know how you even was able to tap that, bro. That's the homies female, bro. Bro, the only thing that that could like I said, the only thing that could end, I could end up like in a situation where I tap the homies female is under like under the influence, bro. Man, hell nah, man. I got a new number. She, you just left me in the past with your old one, huh? Ah, it ain't even like that. I why do you why, bro? You entertaining her, bro? Why do you mean it ain't even like that? Yes, good dog. Yes, you in the past. Fuck going out of here, man. You got a lot going on. I ain't had no chance to text you. She, ah, uh, okay. Well, you can give me your new number now. Hell uh, no. Nah. Bro, what is you doing? Bro, we can never win, bro.
This the reason why people be saying, bro, men are some stupid ass dudes, bro. What is you doing, bro? It's like, bro, I ain't like I'm, I ain't trying to say she ugly or whatever, but bro, you already got tip. Pause. Her name is weird. I don't I ain't gonna lie. You already got tip, bro. She provides you with anything. She got her own money. She not a headache. What is you doing with this pregnant lady, man? Bro, these goof ass niggas. Two a seven, three three. Woo, she. Ah, uh, okay. And you could have texted me as soon as you changed it, but I'ma let you live. Man, shut up, man. Yo, it's crazy. What the fuck is all of this entitlement coming from? <coughs> you delusional. What's wrong with you? She. It's a lot of things that's wrong with me, but you one of my most recent problems. The. Ah, uh, I man. Well, you got my line before grabbing my car sheet. Who you grocery shopping for? Some. <sighs> ah, this for me and my little sister while you talking. You do too much. She, oh, I actually don't do enough. Let's go get something to eat. My treat. Ah, what if I ate already? She, where you finna eat again? Is you cool? LOL and not. Yo, it's crazy. I'm finna finish my grocery shop. She, nah, what you finna do is leave that car right there and re grocery shop later. Motioning me to follow her. Brazil now was finna eat anyway, so I obliged. <sighs> what is you doing, bro? Yo, bro. Bro, I never really understood why, like, in Chicago, y'all be saying someone is a Buford, bro. But in this situation right now, bro, this guy is a big Buford, bro. He got, bro, I don't care, bro. There was, he was not the first one. Bro, he's a real Buford. What is this? <sighs> she took me to this little ice cream parlor. We partaking in the portions, walking. She, you like it? After a spoonful, out, yeah, it's decent. She. Which ice cream you like more? This or mine? Choking on my soft serve vibe. G, what you be on, G? She, what you talking about? I'm just asking a question, Scud. Now it was three dudes conversing on the sidewalk. Responding to Amber, I, I plead the fifth. One of the dudes, hey, ugly folks, let me ask you a question real quick, man. I, uh <coughs> Wait, Responding to Amber, I, I plead the fifth. One of the dudes, hey ugly folks, let me ask you. Bro, I wish they, bro, I wish they could get on his ass and roast this stupid ass, cause bro, he pissing me off. Bro. Real quick, man. Ah, ugly folks, looking at him. He, nah, I'm just fucking with you, man. <laughs> nah, let me ask you a question though. Ah, ah, right, what's up? He, hey, real quick, folks, I'm trying to let my homies know who really got these. You feel me? Who really cold with the work? So, y'all two gonna be the judge of what we finna do real quick. Hmm? They finna hit these. We finna see who really got it. You feel me? Shrugging. They finna be dancing or something. I one of them. I my name Stilo from the Air Force Work Crew, man. Watch. Man, I bet. Bro, I didn't come here to watch some Disney Channel type of like Disney movie type of thing where goofballs be singing or dancing, bro. What's this? Get yeah, right to it. He. I'm not gonna lie, bro. This this dance I, I I ain't trying to disrespect nobody. It's like, hmm. Chicago, they be saying it's a tough place, whatever. It's it's it, it's grimy, whatever, whatever. And then you got and you got goofballs dancing like this. It's like, man, I ain't gonna lie, man. Even if you had, even if you had like multiple dudes with switches on my head, bro. And this is how y'all be dancing. Nah, man, I cannot take y'all niggas seriously, bro. Real talk, I ain't trying to troll. I don't get this type of dance. It's like it looks goofy, man. Y'all be saying like a lot of people be saying them 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 New York dudes be be looking zesty when they do their little dance. Uh, 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 uh. I'm not gonna that that dance is tough. This is goofy. It's like why is y'all here dancing like a cartoon character? Me and Amber nodded with approval. 
The second one step up, man. Big folks. P top from the Air Footwork crew, boy. Boy, you better not cause no earthquakes. And proceeded to get right to it. Heat. All I'm seeing, bro, is a bunch of is, is just blubber just moving around, bro. All I see is fatness just moving around. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm on my heat and shit right now. <laughs> mm -hmm. Bro, he's scaring the hell out of me. I'm thinking he about to fall. Ah, that big boy can move. The third one. I right, man. My name Light Bob. Y'all already know my body of work, man. And instantly. I'm not going to lie. He cooking y'all goof ass, boy. He cooking y'all. It's like, how do I put this? It's harder to win. It's hard to win in a dance battle against a skinny person because they move much more freely, bro. Okay, he cooked y'all. He cooked y'all. But his spin was insane. I ain't even gonna lie to you. Light bulb. All right, now who got that shit, man? I right. man. No. It's it's it's, it's kind of hard to call. What you mean, bro? He cooked them. He cooked them. I don't I don't I, I don't get the dance, but he cooked that goofy. Oh, for real, P top boy, you an undecisive ass pigeon. You bogus as hell with your charcoal Quavo. Look, what you mean you don't know? Motherfuckers tried to heat. D lo, what about you, Miss Mama? What you think? Amber just smiled and shrugged. Whole time. Who y'all think had the most ferocious feet over there? That skinny goofball. Was it Stilo, P Top, a ball? Drop it in the comments and let me know. P Top, man, motherfuckers got musty for nothing out here. Can with you? Motherfuckers got to try in the heat again. He man, you better go home and get and take two baths with your fat ass. Goofy, man, cook rattlesnake looking. They pimp <laughs> off. Right after that, I get a text message. It's Sandy Sheet. I'm ready now. Where you at? I. Blessings downtown, whole time sheet. Look at God, me too. I'm on Wabash in Washington. I walking distance, lol. Here I come, sheet back. Amber, you real bold texting another bitch in front of me like I won't pack your ass up. I man, it's about giving this lady this money for my new apartment. You do too much. Come on, we pimp off. Sandy was posted <sighs> by this hey, damn. pillow over by the stairs to the train. Walking up, I Sandy, what's good with you? Not gonna lie, she holding. Turn and she. Bartholomew. That'll be $3,500. Gut punch out. Okay. $35? Dang. I upbred and count. Sandy. Oh, you his baby mom's. Amber. No, he just my friend. With a deep sigh. All right. $3,500. Sandy. Okay. The rent will be $2,500 a month. The rest of this includes my fee and the fees associated with applying for the apartment. I okay, okay. All right. Man, thank you so much. I definitely appreciate you. She, I, right, but look, though, I had to do a little finessing with the documents and stuff mm. to get you in there. But if a red flag pop up and they put you out, I will put you in something else free of charge. I, mm. I can't even be mad at it for real, That's man. Tough. I'm just glad to be in my new little woo wop. Thank you. She, you welcome. Well, y'all have a good day. And pimped off with her posterior. I mean, profit. <laughs> Shortly after, me and Amber walking down the street. I'm. Ain't no way her water breaking. Or what the hell they be saying it? Water breaking or water broke? Her water broke. Is the water breaking or the water break? I don't know, bro. I don't see myself having no kids, so I don't really know what, what's to this thing, man. So, on my thoughts, I don't even know that she not walking next to me. I look back. She linked against the wall looking like she in pain. I, you good? She, I don't know. I'm cramping real bad. Grabbing her stomach. I'm like, nah, she ain't never finna go in the lake. Nah, man. You piped them with the homies. F female? I don't know who the, I, I don't know why I said something in my home language. Bro, it's like, how to put this? You piping the homies uh, female. And we don't know whether the child is or not. 
and she about to have a baby with you present is crazy work man i'm not i turned my head couldn't believe it Teezy sitting in traffic in a black <laughs> truck he spot me i'm looking like a deer caught in the headlights he instantly up and cock on that with me he get the blown okay i do not wish I, I didn't i didn't want her to get show me uh murked or whatever but damn <laughs> I turned to run, he catch my side. I felt the burn of the bullet. I instantly hit the ground. Damn. First time being shot. That shit hurt so bad. I'm screaming. <laughs> I wonder what he look what he looked like <laughs> when people are passing, cause he's literally in a public area, bro. <laughs> and down I hit Shrrr. He hit me in broad daylight on a public street. Luckily some lady called an ambulance. Unfortunately, Amber got hit too. Luckily, the ambulance went far away. The paramedics come rushing to my side. I'm out there crying like a baby. I ain't even gonna lie to you. Stretched out in the street, spot newsworthy. The EMT dude, hey, where you hit at? Crying out, my side. <laughs> he, how many gunshots did you hear? I, about two or three times. It's a pregnant girl. I think she got hit too, y'all got her. He, <laughs> hey, we got another ambulance that got her, okay? In the midst of my crisis, looking out. Is that Polo Assassin? The EMT lady huh? Blouse was humble as hell. She, boy, we're about the wrong thing. Yo, it's up in a die. I type I type shit. EMT, dude, all right, we finna get you on the stretcher, okay? I, I crying looking ugly as hell. <sighs> they load me up onto the ambulance. My side was on fire. Felt like somebody had a hot comb to my sh The EMT lady, I need you to stay calm. What's your name? I, Bartholomew. Nah, y'all is a beaufer. Uh, EMT dude, hop on. He, alright, we gotta get your shirt cut off, okay? The lady, Bartholomew, stand still and rip my shirt. Imagine you got them, them, them expensive ass shirts. I kind of think of like a designer brand shirt that I know the amount of money for. Let me see, bro. How do I put this? F it, bro. Imagine you got a, you just bought a thousand dollar shirt. And they gotta cut it. Third down the middle. Strong <laughs> as hell. Dude, here, he's losing too much blood. We gotta patch him up. The lady trying her best to stop the bleeding. I'm looking down at all that blood. I'm freaking out at this point. But here, listen to his lungs, see if he's breathing okay. The lady put the stethoscope to my chest, breathing and crying. I'm. <gasps> Dude, he's not looking too good. Let's get ready to intubate him. Ah. Right. EQ, babe. Hmm? What's that? He, that means we're gonna stick a tube down your throat, Bartholomew. Ugh. Stick, stick some down my throat. What did he pause? Or the lady, trust me, it's for your own good, Bartholomew. I, for my own good, you in cahoots, bro? He, they gonna put that, they gonna, they gonna insert that thing while he's like, he's up or something. I don't know why they only like, I don't know, like an injection first. Then like he passes out, then they put that bro. He's bro. He's gonna feel weird pushing something down. Why you actually, bro? He gonna feel everything. This did it too. She boy, calm down, dude. All right, well let's get up out of here. Letting the driver know to pull off. I'm on the back going through it. Couple hours later, they had me stable at the hospital, patched up and everything. The doctor walk in. He Bartholomew Smith. Turning to him, I. Yeah, that's me. He. So how you feel? Ah, a little sore, but um, nah, and nah. It could be worse. He, definitely the attitude to have. Luckily, no major arteries were hit. <laughs> Winston and pain, and I definitely felt like it. Why you speak like My that? <laughs> he, could have been much more. Trust me, with a deep sigh, I, you the doc. I'm sure you know. He, the police said you didn't have much to say about who shot you. I, I had to be at the wrong place at the wrong time. Outside of that, I don't know too much of nothing, but the girl that was with me, she was pregnant and she was hit too. Any information on her? Did they even bring her to this hospital? He, what's her name? Ah, Amber. I, I, I don't know her last name though. He. I believe they took her to the hospital that houses her primary care. SMH and I, I hope everything okay with her. He, if I can get any information about her. Have you ever been like, I don't know, drinking something or eating something, then you just look at the box like, 
Man, why the hell they put in there, motherfucker, man? Man, it may taste as hell. I'll definitely share with you. I, I really appreciate it. He, we would really like you to return a favor and share any information about who shot you. I had to keep this one in the streets. I ain't gonna lie. I, I wish I could. He, I hear you. You should be able to be discharged tomorrow morning. I, I appreciate it, Doc. You think they could bring me some of them graham crackers? He, I'll see what I can do. And walked out. A black doctor. I loved it to see it. I know my little sister had to be wondering where I was at. So I pulled my phone out to FaceTime her. She answered. I, hello? She, oh my God, brother, what happened to you? I, I'm okay, sister. <laughs> I got shot. She, you didn't get shot because of what happened to that man in the alley, did you? Ah. Yeah, no. Nah. This ain't had nothing to do with that. She, okay. When you coming home? Ah. They said I can get out of here tomorrow. Is everything okay with you and the little one? She, yeah. She sleep. Ah. All right. Well, hold it down. Brother, be that tomorrow. <sighs> I love you. She, okay. I love you too, brother. I hang up. Right after that, I get a FaceTime call. Jeez. It's from the motorcyclist. Ah, hello? He, looks like you're in the hospital, man. You good? Ah, yeah, I'm good. Just had a little situation, but uh, all's well. He, you probably could use some good news right about now. I got 10 racks for you. Hmm? Ah, $10,000? He, US currency. Hmm. Just got to complete a little task. I, okay. I ain't gotta kill nobody, do I? He, not this time. Just need to know you're on board before I share it, though. I need y'all help. I'm not gonna lie, man. Need my help. I need y'all help. Fuck out of here with that shit, bro. Just get this money at this point. Because you're already doing some stupid things. It's like, you're already too deep in, bro. Might as well just go do everything that is stupid at this point. The doctor say I'm getting discharged tomorrow. I am running low on bread. I had to up 3500 for Sandy earlier. He say I ain't got to kill nobody either. Mm. And this is for 10 racks. What y'all think? Should I take the opportunity for the 10 bands? Or leave it alone? There ain't no telling what it is. Drop it in the comments and let me know. And on the next episode of Black Chicago Be Like Part 119, Part 15, we're going to see what's next. Sorry. Wait on y'all. Oh, God. Beautiful ass dude, bro. I'm gone, man. Call me Master Zang because I'm a flippy bass.